Welcome to the Poor Man's Gourmet Kitchen, where we share gourmet recipes at a low budget wonder. Now check this out. Following a regular box of macaroni instructions, we've cooked our pasta. We'll be adding some olive oil for a little bit of flavor and to assure that the noodles don't stick. We'll be stepping up this recipe quite a bit, so pay attention. In another pan, we've got the recommended amount of butter, which is a quarter cup. And we're going to add a quarter cup of half and half instead of milk. You can use cream if you prefer, but this is a nice balance between the two. We're going to wait for this to melt down just a little bit, but we're going to add some other ingredients. Here we've got some nutmeg and some black pepper. And then of course give this a good stir. Now very critical, you want to keep this sauce from burning. So you need to add just a pinch more half and half, off and on. You want to bring up the boil, which is important. And then you're going to add your cheese packet. It'll thicken up very quickly when you do this. So it's important to stir that in and at the same time add your pasta. At this point it'll be so thick you're going to have to add more half and half. Or cream, whichever you prefer. But you'll see at this point, now we've got enough. You'll stir until it looks very creamy, like this. And that's important and it's essential that it's creamy because we're going to bake it. And when you bake it, it'll dry out if it's not creamy enough your dish, cover just the bottom with just enough, and then add some cheddar cheese. And then cover the rest of it with the remaining amount of macaroni. Once you get it all in there, we're going to top it off with some mozzarella. And then just for kicks, a little bit of panko. This will get a, a little bit of a crispy crunch. And off to the oven. This will take about 12 minutes at 425 degrees. And here it is. Got a nice golden crisp look to the top. Nice and melted. Just the way you want it. There you have it. Mac and cheese. Right here in the poor man's gourmet kitchen. Thank you for watching and be sure to stop by poormansgourmetkitchen.com for more recipes and exact ingredients.